they just bought this house so here's the fixer this is russell Hudson's first real estate investment deal we're gonna fix and flip it so these guys are basically at home doing school we figured the best way to learn is to actually get involved firsthand so you can actually see how the whole process works so look at the invest with us and they come out and see and they're gonna be in the whole journey on how we're gonna turn this into a beautiful home and then sell and make profit so when you outfit looking at houses what type of houses are the idea fix and flip old junky houses with like old windows and overgrown grass and the inside is old and uh, stinky. This house stink bad inside, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? You didn't even start yet, dude. Bad, I can't believe someone was living in this house. How much money did it cost to do this one of these kind of deals? We both put in $8,000 and then they put in 50000 So it cost us about $70,000 investment to do this deal. We bought this for three fifty. dollars It's going to cost us about probably $90,000. And we're hoping to sell for $600,000 and double our investment. So stay tuned, you guys. We're going to show you guys more video. This house is going to be done in 90 days. All right, we are taking Russell Hudson out to go pick material for their first fix and flip they're doing, you guys. Hudson, what's the first thing you pick when you do a fix and flip? The floor, because it covers most of the house. That's right. Once you pick the floor, then it's easy to match everything else with the floor, okay? How about you, Russell? What did you learn today? You got to match the cost of the material with the cost of the house. That's right. You don't want to spend too much money on material based on the price of the property. So you gotta know how much the home you're gonna sell for, then you make sure you pick all the material that line up to the price. Got it? We are at the fixer upper, that Russell Hudson first fix and flip. Hudson, what'd you learn so far? That the first thing you need to do is clear everything out of the house. That's right, you gotta demo the house, you guys, and if I'm there, we can figure out how we're gonna remodel the house. What'd you learn so far, Russell? You have to find a good contractor so you can fix everything and clear everything out before you lose money the longer you take. That's right, you guys. The faster you can get the work done, the more money you make because you pay less interest. The key is time is money. That's right, you guys. Got it? We're at the property of Mr. Russell Hudson. This is their first investment flip they're doing. The last episode you guys saw, the house was pretty much gutted. Everything was gone. The basement was all, you know, basically all emptied out. Now the house is all put together now. Everything's going in, the cabinets going in, doors are going in, floors are going in, trim going in. So now the thing is looking good. But I wanted to see what Russell Hudson reaction since the last time that was here. Last time this he's guy was here, he almost threw up. You guys remember that? So <laughs> what's your thoughts now since you've been in the house now? Um, it is a lot more brighter inside and you can actually walk in there because before the smell was so bad, now it actually smells good. That's right. What about you? What's your thoughts now? This house looks totally different after being gutted and it looks so much better with the new tiles and the new cabinets that we chose. That's right. Those guys chose all the finishes. They chose the cabinet, they chose the floor, they chose the tile. And so now they got to see the work. Now they're impressed with it. So you guys, we're going to be wrapping up. All, we're going to hang all the door, put all the faucet on and all the door handle on. And this house is going to be cleaned up after that. This is Russell Hudson's first flip. You guys remember this house? The last time we were here, the cabinet was just getting hung, the countertop was getting put in, the plant was coming in, the house was dirty, it was hanging the door, now the house is all done, cleaned up, all the furniture stage is in. So guys, what does it look like now since all the furniture is in, Russell? The staging made the house look way more colorful and it makes it feel like it's an actual home. That's right. How about you? What do you, what do you think? And now that the stage is in, it helps the buyer know what it's supposed to look like when they fully furnish the house. That's right. You guys, now the next step, we're going to put it on the market and let's set the intention. We're going to get full price or something better. Let's go. All right, we are at the investment that Russell and Hudson first flipped, you guys. Remember the last time we was here, the house just got staged going on the market. And you know what? Guess what happened next? So guess what happened? We put this on the market for how much, Russell? 600000 And we had so many show. We ended up getting multiple offer. And Hudson, how much did we end up selling it for? 660000 That's 60000 over asking price, you guys. Let's, Let's go! go! All right, on the last video we did, we actually showed you guys the deal that Russell Hudson first flipped. Um, we listed it for 600000 and it sold for six sixty. dollars We're going to close today. We're going to show you the breakdown, what it cost to do this deal, how much money they actually made, okay? So we bought the property for three twenty-five. We put a hundred thousand dollars in rehab. We all in for four twenty-five. The down payment was seventy-five thousand dollars, and we both put in eight thousand dollars each, which is ten point six percent of the down payment. That's right. We sold for six hundred sixty thousand, and we netted one forty-five after commission, closing costs, interest, cash costs, everything at the end of the day. Then me and Hudson both made a profit of eight thousand dollars in less than ninety days. That's right. Now you're probably thinking ten point six times one forty-five is about sixteen thousand dollars each. That's right. Since they didn't do all the work, we only gave them half of the sixteen thousand. But still, they made eight thousand dollars off of the eight thousand, which is hundred percent in ninety. That's a damn good deal. You guys ready for the next deal? Yep. Let's go.